This is the unboxing of a Skywatcher eyepiece and I'm going to open it and look at how it is. Now we are seeing the package actually of the eyepiece, so I'm going to remove the rest of the wrapping. Okay, let me push this one out, push this one out, and these are the two eyepieces that I was looking Skywatcher 70 degree wide angle eyepiece, 13 millimeter, and a Skywatcher wide angle, super wide angle, 17 millimeter wide angle, 2 inch. Okay, let's see what is inside the pack. Ooh, wow, big chunky. Oh, it looks very much like a Celestron Ultima LX. It's a 70 degree eyepiece, exactly like the Ultima. The look of it looks the same. Hmm, very interesting. Hmm, quite similar. Quite chunky, heavy. The 17 millimeter eyepiece. Let me just remove it and I now remove the cap. That's the bottom cap, also. I'm going to remove quite chunky. And these are the two eyepieces side by side. Uh, 13 millimeter is long is bigger slightly It's probably because it has a smite barlow The screws are missing here. They should have had two screws Let me just see in the pack. It seems unfortunately the screws are missing so I have to find a way to replace them The islands is quite large The eye guard can be twisted and put down or slightly higher. And this one also is twisty. Okay, now I'm putting the 70 millimeter uh, eyepiece into the Skull Watcher ED AT a Pro Series and see how it will show. And that is how it looks like. A very clear image. Beautiful. Bright and clear. Crisp. And now let us do a test viewing in daylight with the 30 millimeter. So I remove this and put the 30 millimeter there. So this is the 13 millimeter and I'm going now to have a look. Crisp and beautiful images. And if the camera can focus and show exactly what I see with the eye visually, uh, you will see how crisp it is. Very wide angle. I can say 70 millimeters is really good. Uh, 
Beautiful image. And that is the Sky Watcher 30 millimeter super wide angle, 70 degrees, fully multi coated, uh, modular, one, uh, one and a quarter and two inch uh, piece. I'm now using the two inch version, two inch uh, focuser size. All in all, this two looks like a very good eyepiece. Probably I should try the 5mm or 7mm one if I find them. Very good eye relief. Very clear image. Sharp.